Welcome to 5 Minute School and in today's video we're going to be talking about the synthesis of adrenal corticoids. So we're going to be talking primarily about cortisol and aldosterone. And just to recap some information about the adrenal glands, you can see them located on the top, the superior borders of the kidney. They consist of the outer cortex and the inner medulla and they both function as separate glands. Now all adrenal cortical steroid hormones are synthesized from cholesterol. Cholesterol is transported into the adrenal glands and um, these steps, well basically the cholesterol transporting into the gland occur in most steroid producing tissues. So we have some steps which I've written here for the production of aldosterone and cortisol and uh, it primarily occurs within the adrenal cortex. So we have progesterone. Uh, which is a precursor of both of these steroid hormones. We have hydroxylation at the carbon 21 in the case for aldosterone. We then get 11 deoxycorticosterone and then we have two further hydroxylations at carbon 11 and carbon 18 and that gives us aldosterone. In the case of cortisol, we have progesterone again. We have hydroxylation at carbon 17, and that gives us 17 alpha hydroxyprogesterone. Then we have hydroxy, uh, hydroxylation at carbon 21, which gives us 11 deoxycortisol. We then have hydroxylation at carbon 11, and then finally we end up with cortisol.